So congratulations. A win on the famous Blackpool Winter Garden stage. How did it feel? Well, I feel great. It's the first time I play here. And the first win in the World Match play, so I can be my, more happy than this. Where does this particular tournament, the Betfred World Match Play, feature for you? Is this one that you particularly watched on TV before you came over and started playing PDC regularly? No, for me it's like another uh, tournament. Of course, all the tournaments, you know, they are important. Um, this tournament, uh, I start with a good feed. <laughs> so, I'm happy to through to the second round. And second round, it's a little bit more complicated, but I'm here. Well, look, Gabriel Clemens, German number one, great player, but he caused you no problems at all. Tonight. No, well, I, I expect more than uh, than this. He, have, he is a great player. He, I'm sure he can do better than this, than this, this night. Uh, but this night, I think, if you can play your best game against me, you are not. It seems a little difficult. You come into this with enormous How confidence, and rightly so. Some of the performances you've put in have been incredible. Do you believe you're the best player in this tournament? No, no. Actually, I speak with my manager. And before I go to the stage, I don't feel the grip of my dad. Uh, and then in the stage, uh, I say to him, well, uh, since I like I, I, I go to the through to the bull who, who goes first, the things change. So I hope in the stage that the things change and my feeling with uh, my dad change too. And that's what I, that's what that's what happens. It's a unique venue. It's pretty hot. It's going to get hotter. Yeah, that's and we'll, yeah. we'll have a full house yeah. when you play next. Does that make it harder or easier or no difference? Uh, well, actually, you know, my shorts now it's a little bit more short. Yeah. Uh, that uh, except that's why um, I ask my shorts uh, a little bit short because before it's over here mm -hmm. and when you throw the dart so the first dart the, it just stay there you know uh, with my, my heart now it's move with uh, the arm and the, the, you know, the temperature. So it's easier to play yes. in the heat. No. What about the fans being there and the noise? Is that a factor for you? No, not at all. No. Uh, like I showed to the people before in the Premier League, I played the semi finals and the final with the crowd, and I feel very, very calm with the crowd. Uh, I'm a different player than two years or three years ago. Yeah. Michael Smith, for you next, one of the few players who has beaten you more times yeah. than you've beaten him. Is, yeah. Do you consider him a particularly difficult opponent? Well, every player is difficult, uh, but Michael Smith is, is, he has talent, so much talent, so, uh, well, if, I, if I, can, I can play my best game, maybe on, I'm sure I can beat him, but uh, we are two strong players and we never know who are going to win tomorrow, uh, next, next round. It'll be fun finding out. Well done, Jose. Thank you. Jose, many congratulations. As you said to Dan, first time here at the Winter Gardens, did it take your breath away when you walked out there for the first time, just the venue and everything? Oh, thank you. Uh, well, um, can you repeat, sorry? I said, the first time here, when you went out there for the first time to look at the venue and play on the stage, mm -hmm. did it take your breath away because it's an iconic venue? No, uh, I just, well, for me it's a normal uh, tournament. Uh, I go over there, like the other tournaments. Uh, since I, I feel calm with the crowd, there's no problem with that. So, for me it was normal. You come here off the back of an amazing Super Series, yeah. some huge, huge averages. Are you looking to emulate what you do on the floor, on the stage, and can you produce those big averages <laughs> in front of the fans? Well, I hope so. Uh, I still play better now uh, in front of the fans. and um, 
I think I oh I show to everybody I can play with with crowd. Uh, I have so much fans now with me and people who likes my my game and yeah. Um, maybe can I, I make some average, big average in front of the crowd? It was, if I can do that, it was uh, uh, wonderful for everybody. I know you've been playing it, Dan, saying you're not the best player no. here, but your stats would suggest you are. The big averages, winning tournaments after tournament. Inside, are you secretly thinking, I can win this? Uh, well, uh, usually I go step by step. Uh, I never think, well, if I can get the semi-final and then the final and then no. Uh, I, I like to go step by step, little by little, slowly. Uh, think in the next game, if I win in the next game. And uh, I think that's the best way I can work with, um, uh, you know, uh, it's these players, they are so difficult to beat. Uh, so you can think about that if I go win or not. You have to think in the next player, yeah, and that's that's how I work. Joseph, thank you very much as always. Welcome, Jose. You came into this event as one of the favourites. A lot of people were talking about you. How, how does that feel? Well, I feel great. Uh, finally, the people speak about me. <laughs> I think it's a great thing. But uh, it, I think it was. Oh, they speak about the things I do. Because now I'm one one of the the best players in the world in this moment. I don't feel that way because I work so much to make um, better things, uh, play better my game. Uh, you know, uh, I'm really happy to know that. We know you had that amazing Grand Slam win, but do you feel the Premier League has taken your game to a next level, playing the best players over 17 nights? Yes, of course, absolutely. Uh, Premier League is the 10 best players of the world over there. May make the final, it's amazing for every, every player. I mean, uh, every game it's a final over there in the Premier League. So, uh, make the final for me, it's a dream come true and uh, the feel, my work, uh, all my work results in the good things, in the hook, good results. Um, so I'm really happy with all the things I do right now. Thanks, Jose. Thank you. You're welcome. Jose, the Grand Slam um, knockout format is quite similar to what we've got this week at the World Match Play. Do you think these longer formats are suited to your game? No, uh, I mean, I always, my mentally, Mentality, it's always the same. And if I have a one month stop, I work in my house myself. Uh, if I have uh, other tournaments, whatever, uh, I go with always the, the same mentality. So um, you know, it doesn't be a, a problem for me. Okay. Okay, so